Hi, hello, I am the Cyber Rave Guru. Thank you for watching. So, it's been a while since I made a video. There's lots of reasons for this. Um, and I just wanted to make a video to kind of talk about where I've been over the last couple months and why I have not necessarily made a video. And what's likely gonna change in the future. So let's get on with it, if it were. If it was, if it were. Hmm. Let's just get on with it. All right, so right off the bat, I've been working on a lot of different projects. Uh, unfortunately, the projects have been what I will characterize as repetitive in nature. Uh, you know, I've made a couple videos before in the past about cutting boards and a variety of other things, and I've been making a lot of cutting boards, uh, a couple inlay cutting boards, a couple multi uh, wood cutting boards, some thinner ones, uh, face grain and edge grain, not end grain. And I didn't necessarily feel like it was worthy of creating yet another cutting board video. So I am interested if you all, the watchers and or subscribers to this channel are interested in those videos or not, but I chose not to get any of you that, um, and therefore, because I've been so busy in the garage doing a lot of this work, I haven't really been posting any videos because it's been really eating up all my spare time. So um, that's kind of problem number one. Uh, problem number two is I've been working on some house projects that uh, just don't lend themselves to video making. Uh, I had some issue with the door, so I had to fix a door jam. I had some issues in the garage, I had to do some uh, ceiling work for some, um, some dry board in the ceiling. We're currently in the middle of, unfortunately, unplanned bathroom remodel. Uh, I might actually get some video of that, but unlikely, um, outsides. And then, you know, we, we did a little bit of vacationing and then I had a, a tournament that was far away and I did get video of that and I posted it on my, on another channel that I have that is not this main channel. So just really been super busy with lots of different projects, uh, that are not video worthy or at least in my opinion, would be duplicative and or redundant with things that I've already done. So I've just chosen not to make videos. Uh, so that's kind of number two. The third part is, you know, I have this long list of projects that I want to do, and I just have not been able to get a chance to do them in a way that would produce videos that I think that are interesting. So and I'm struggling with that right now because I, I'm, I'm not in a dry spot from a video making content perspective, but I am in a dry spot for videoing the content, if that makes any sense at all. So, uh, you know, I'm going to uh, try to get out of this kind of rut that I'm in right now and kind of get back into making these videos, which is why I wanted to make this video, just kind of give a status update. Uh, it's been uh, a couple weeks, and then, you know, prior to the last video I posted, it was a couple weeks before that, and then, um, you know, I just, I, I need to get back into the video making process. And it's not so much actually the recording process uh, that is the time consuming part. It's actually the editing process and the finalization of the video. Uh, a lot of times I make videos and um, uh, the, the footage sits on the phone or on the, uh, on the camera for weeks, if not months, before I can get a chance to stitch together and make a, a video that I believe is watchable. So that's a problem that I'm going to try and... Uh, I can't say, say solve, but uh, it's a problem I'm going to try and address here uh, just by making more time to sit down and edit and, and less time working on specific details of the project. But anyway, like I said, got some big upcoming projects. Hopefully I will be able to do some video for it uh, after we get beyond this ridiculous uh, bathroom remodel that we were not planning. So. And uh, hopefully sometime in the future, uh, you will see my significant other in videos because she uh, has watched videos of others, uh, Evan and Caitlin in particular, and said, hey, you know, we can do that. And so I challenged her, uh, actually I have some video of it, I challenged her uh, to participate in the process and just see how not easy it is or how challenging the process is because uh, some people think making these videos is super easy, you know, pick up a phone, make a video and uh, 
you move out and gain thousands of subscribers and that might be true for some people it just simply is not true for me <laughs> it is what it is all right so uh that's a quick update for the channel and what we're, what's going on here uh, i am going to be posting some videos real soon uh, i've done a couple projects that I have video for that I'm gonna to stitch together over the next probably week or so, and then I will stagger out the rollout of the uh, videos for you all. So hey, a couple things. Any questions, certainly leave them down below, but more importantly, suggestions on things you want to see, leave them down below. I've been watching the statistics on the channel and the videos where I've done uh, tool reviews seem to resonate with people. Um, they're not necessarily my f most favorite videos to make because uh, it doesn't really produce anything that is useful for me and this channel for me anyway is about making things that are useful. Um, but if people are interested in tool videos, uh, review videos, um, I'm happy to do them. I'm only gonna review things that I have purchased myself for my own personal use and I've used myself for my own personal use. Uh, and then I will offer my thoughts and my opinions about those. I have at least two, if not three of those uh, queued up. I have not uh, recorded them yet, but I plan to. Um, I've purchased some things recently that are worthy of a review or at least some commentary about the uh, the tool the, the tool itself uh, or the product itself as well as my experience with them whether that's good or bad so I plan I do plan on doing that um, I will be out uh, of pocket a little bit in uh, I guess the end of October middle of October for earth 2019 uh, it's a 3d printing convention Coming up soon, uh, so if you have any interest of attending ERF and you want to, uh, you know, maybe catch up with me, uh, I will post the link to the ERF uh, website and the, the convention or uh, symposium, I don't know what you want to call it. Uh, so there's going to be some notable people there if you follow this channel. Uh, I believe uh, 3D Printing Nerd is going to be there. I do believe uh, uh, Pooch with his rep box will be there. Uh, there will be other folks... Uh, Lauren from Abuzz Designs and some, uh, I believe, Travis will also be there um, from the website that he runs. <laughs> I met Travis last year. I met Pooch last year. They're, they're great human beings as well as Lauren and her husband, the van full of puppies. So that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. If you made it this far, I appreciate it. Um, down below are some links, affiliate links, if you want to exercise your buying power to buy anything that I might use. And as I do project reviews, I will also leave the links to those as well. So once again, thank you for watching. Thank you for making it this far. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't, what the heck, give it a thumbs up anyway. Really appreciate it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, ring that bell. Very important these days. And be inspired.